everybody, welcome back to another episode of Shane's Craft Beer Review. Got another big beer for you today from Counterpart Brewing here in Niagara Falls. So this is the Vic Secret Flow. This is a hazy pale ale, 5.2% alcohol by volume, big 32 ounce, 32 ounce crowler. Can't wait to get into this. Let's pop it open. And as you can see, I got the big, big glass for the big, big can. Ooh, oh, spitting all over the place. Fantastic. Love it. All right. Let's get this big beer in the big glass, shall we? Oh, that's going to go in there so nice. Absolutely fans damn fantastic. The only thing I hate, the only thing I hate about these crowlers is they tend to leak all over the damn place. I think it's just the way the uh, the mouth of them is done. But uh, yeah, I always have a hard time with these crowlers. Do you guys have a hard time with crowlers? I don't know. Maybe it's just me, or maybe it's just counterpart. They don't have the mouth done quite right. I have no idea. All right. Ooh, that was kind of loud, probably. Let's take a look at this in my big steam missile mug. That looks. Freaking glorious right there. Let's give her a nose. Wow, super tropical. Yeah, I can't wait to dive into this one. Let's get her done. Cheers. Actually, let's get rid of some of this foam first. There's a lot of foam there. Hmm. Foam tastes great. Let's get into the beer. Cheers. Mmm, that is quite nice. Quite nice indeed. Getting all those nice typical tropical flavors in there. Nice and smooth, easy to drink. 5.2%. You can sit there and this this will be your go-to for the day. You can probably have two of these and be just fine. Just a touch of bitterness in there. Um, really nice. I, I really, really like this one. I, I don't think I've ever had a beer that j it just had Vic Secret in it before. Um, it's a good hop. I really like it. Quite tasty. Quite tasty. Quite enjoyable. I could definitely see myself sitting there drinking these all day. No problem at all. It's got just enough bitterness to keep me interested. Good tropical flavors. And again, 5.2%. So yeah, it's an all day drinker. Anyway, guys, on a scale of one to five, I'm going to give this a solid 375 really, really decent. I do like it. If you get a chance and you happen to be in the Niagara Falls area, or you know a guy who lives around there, definitely, uh, definitely give it a little check out. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you next time.